Welcome to Emo 2023. We're on the spinner booth. This is my buddy, Salim. Uh, Salim, how many machines do we have on this beautiful booth? Over 20 machines, Tony. All running? Incre yeah, all running. Incredible. We got turning and milling here on this side. Well, we're here in Germany, which we're very excited about. You yeah. and I both came from the U.S. I know, recovering still. <laughs> we are recovering a little bit. Headed into Mexico a little bit as a North American guy in charge. Really growing in the U.S. as well. But let's give a little history because we are here in Germany. German right. engineering, German brand, German reliability. A little history on Spinner for the audience watching right yeah, now. Yeah, so Spinner been around since 1949, originally from uh, Munich, Germany, family-owned company still. We sell approximately 100 uh, 1,200 machines a year in Europe, growing in North America. So we have in North America, of course, covering Canada, the United States, and Mexico. And we're sliding into Mexico a little bit more. All that reshoring going on, we're excited about there. I have to ask you, because with all of these machines here, this beautiful, actually, your booth is really incredible and large. I'm excited to be here. But do you have anything new that you'd like to announce to the audience? Anything we'd like to showcase to our global audience? Yeah, well, funny you said we got the new, new. Oh! <laughs> Do you see how it's there? The new, yeah. new. Can we slide the over new, there? New, new, absolutely. Here. All right. So, so Robin is over here, and uh, Robin uh, is her colleague here in Germany, but assisting us in the North American market as well. And this is a very exciting product for us. It's TS85, and just you know, state of the art, latest technology in lathe innovation. So maybe Robin can tell us a little more. Yeah, let's hear from Robin a little bit. I know you're excited about this for Texas and the U.S. market as well for everyone. Pay attention to the details of Robin because the oil industry is currently booming. And Salim, great job by Spinner out in that part of the country. So, Robin, I'm actually going to hand you the You just have to give the details to the audience watching right now. Oh, that's exactly right. Yeah, so this is the TS85. Here in the duplex uh, configuration, um, the NEMS tells it that it's 85 millimeter bathroom machine. Can also come with 125 bar capacity. Um, we have it here with two turrets, one upper, one lower turret. That's the duplex configuration. We have it with single turret. We have it with triple turret with three turrets as well. Um, you can have steady rest, multiple steady rest in the machine. So a great machine for, for big parts uh, that need to be uh, high efficiency, a um, lot of tools in the cut. Yeah. Very well done, Rob. So expanding over to the U.S. market a little bit, and I'm going to ask you a question. We have two turrets here. You can start with one. You can get up to four, and the size of it is massive. Is that why the oil industry down in Texas is just right. drooling over this machine currently? Right. So this is a unique machine for this kind of uh, a machining work that really is going to have very high demands in precision and size and the ability to manage chips. For example, when you see in here in this machine, you can see how easy it is to manage chips, right? The way that it's a 90 degree bed, the openness of it, no cables, just beautiful. Uh, the layout, the, the way in, in which the operator is going to be to manage the, the, the machine Super is going to be fantastic. Super good uh, accessibility to the tools to set up the machine. Um, really easy, which makes it fun for the operator to, to run this machine. As well. And something I'd like to bring up for everyone watching that I've seen in shops all the time as we get into automation is the conveyor back here where the chips actually exit from because you notice the angle that it goes up and the size of the bin that can slide underneath. How many times in automation are we running through the nights and weekends, the bins fill up and they right. run out of places to put it? So this type of creativity is the German engineering that you guys can rely on. So with that being said, let's bring in my colleague Fernanda to do a little bit in Spanish because I know we're expanding into the Mexican market as well. Absolutely. Thank you, Tony. Hola, Fernanda. Hola, Salim, ¿cómo estás? Bien, gracias. ¿Qué tal? También muy bien. Oye, escuchando lo que le comentabas a Tony, que están creciendo en Norteamérica. Cuéntame un poquito más de esto para que nuestra audiencia en México, que aún no los conocen, sepan más sobre Spinner. Bueno, primero que todo, gracias, Fernanda, por visitarnos aquí en Alemania. Uh, tú sabes que siempre hemos tenido la relación con los clientes en México. Es importante que entiendan que de ahora en adelante van a tener el soporte, refacciones, servicio, maquinaria disponible directamente a todos los clientes de México. ¿Y con, y con, ¿con quién se pueden comunicar directamente con ustedes? Directamente con nosotros. Uh, tenemos unas personas en México que nos ayudan localmente y estamos creciendo en el ámbito de soporte, como te estaba diciendo, y también inventario y disponibilidad de maquinaria. Oye, cuéntale un poquito a nuestra audiencia, ¿qué tipos de equipos son los que manejan para el mercado norteamericano? Generalmente tornos, uh, fresadoras, 
uh, y equipo de automatización también. Todo hecho en Alemania. Y si queremos conocer un poco más de sus productos, ¿en dónde los podemos encontrar? ¿Alguna página web? ¿En dónde podemos ver las maquinarias? En la página están? web, uh, por supuesto, spinnernorthamerica.com. Excelente, Salim. Antes de terminar, ¿quieres decirnos en dónde los pueden visitar? ¿El número de stand, el, el pabellón de los 18 que hay? ¿En dónde, claro. ¿en dónde están ubicados? Este es el pabellón 15, el stand es el C50. Ok, ¿y algo más que de, de, decirnos antes de terminar esta entrevista sobre el, sobre el equipo nuevo que tenemos aquí? No, les agradezco mucho, vengan y lo, y lo, y lo miran y lo checan, uh, creo que van a estar muy impresionados. Excelente, Salim, muchas gracias. Gracias. Absolutely, so now, Emo 2023, we're all Absolutely. excited. This is day one, first thing in the This morning. It. It's already vibrating. I mean, we see the yeah. whole Fanic crew over here hanging yeah. out with you guys yeah. as well. So what booth, where can we find you? We're in Hall 15. Hall 15, C50. Uh, come by, you're going to be very impressed. Uh, this spinner company is the machine tool company you've been looking for. Ooh. We're right here, we're waiting for you, and we hope you can make it. Yes, we do. Thank you all for watching this live from MTD CNC. Robin, thank you so much as thank well, you, my friend. Good to see you. We appreciate you all watching, and we'll see you again soon. Thank you.